hi guys welcome back to another video so today we are storing <laughs> my mark photo cards storing slash reorganizing slash binder makeover um yeah so i split my mark collection into two a5 beyondies okay so let's start with the first binder which will be this one let me just show you guys like a brief overview of the cards <laughs> um not these ones but basically all of this i have to put away in this video <laughs> so um speaking of let me take out the first half which is all of this <laughs> okay so our first binder is this one which is my first um like my original mark binder it has the flower crown little freebie that i put in the, in the front as the cover um i've already put sticky notes and stuff so then i know what card goes where so this binder basically is for mark's earlier photo cards so i think i have um yeah so i have merch cards and Japanese cards at the back for this binder so that is what is in here so let's start with the first four so the first four cards are his pure sets um, I'm using Amifa sleeves for these ones for this binder Amifa is double-sided so I will be double-siding double-siding <laughs> I will be um, filling up both sides of these pages and Amifa pages also fit like um, Dragon Shield's Clear Classics because they are a bit wider and like normal sized so yeah and then on the back side oh I'm so sorry for the glare it's gonna be for the Arrival dolls so I have these ones I will be putting the envelopes in a pocket just to fill up a four page so i think i'm gonna go yeah maybe i'll do photo card envelope maybe i'll put the photo card here and then the envelope and then the photo card on this side and then the envelope over here gosh you guys can't even see it <laughs> okay anyways let's move on to the next four which is the fourth fan meeting cards okay so these are his fourth fan meeting cards but for the first four pockets i will be putting these four in it just because he's wearing the same thing and yeah it's the same concept pretty much so I'm going to start with this one. I believe these are from the study kit um, merch drop. And yeah, these Polaroids are quite hard to get a hold of. I actually never thought I would get them like in my collection. <laughs> but yeah thankfully i was able to find them yay okay that's so cute and then next i am going to put um the other fourth fan meeting card on this page right here and then beside it i'm gonna put um his eyes on you dvd card i'm not sure if there's a blu-ray version or actually i don't even know if this is the dvd version or the blu-ray or whatever but it is from the e it is from the eyes on you dvd <laughs> and then on the bottom i'm going to put his eyes on you tour cards I do love seeing the backs of my cards, but when I took out all of my Mark photo cards, I was very surprised, believe it or not, about how much 
like how many cards I have of his. So for this page, I am going to put his fifth fan meeting Polaroid right here. This is a three set, but I don't have the other two. So I'm just going to put it by itself here. And then for the other three, I'm going to put his keep spinning Polaroid set. And this one is complete. I like to keep my cards um, as chronological as possible. <laughs> so, yeah. There we go. Okay. That is that for this page. And then on this page, I am putting his keep spinning trading cards which is an eight set so i have these four and these four all complete of course um let's see i think i'm gonna put the two selfies together i love mark silver hair I've been dying for him to like bring it back, but I doubt he's gonna do that anytime soon. And it kills me because I really love it a lot. And there we go. And that is his keep spinning set moving on okay so now we're gonna skip this page and move on to this one where we're gonna put his keep spinning DVD card along with his sixth fan meeting cards there's a lot of sixth fan meeting photo cards <laughs> okay so I have his keep spinning DVD right here and then to start his sixth fan meeting photo card i'm going to put this little one i think this one came from the notepad so i'm gonna put this one on this side and then my favorite one <laughs> this is just the normal trading card but I think he's so cute there. Okay. I'm actually filming pretty late at night tonight or this time around. I don't usually film at night, but for some reason I I just I don't feel tired right now. <laughs> and I was like I was looking through my photo card binders and I'm like Hmm, I kind of want to flip through my Mark photo cards, but I couldn't because they're not put away. So that is why I am doing this at, I think it's almost midnight to be honest. That is it for his sixth fan meeting cards. Moving on, we have Summer Go Tune, and finally we have the Homecoming photo cards. So I have his Summer Go Tune from last year or maybe two years ago. Wow, it's been that long? What? I remember when I was like struggling to get these these two because I was still new to the community and I didn't really know like trusted sellers, trusted international sellers. So yeah, anyways. <laughs> and then for the bottom here, I have his homecoming photo cards, the one with the gummy bear and his selfie card. So cute. Okay, so that is it for his merch cards. Now we have his Japanese cards. So, first up, we have his Boy Next Door 
um, clear card that I sleeved in a white dragon oh. <laughs> white dragon shield sleeve <laughs> just so that it'll show up because it is a clear card so anyways that is that <laughs> and then we start with the album for the cards oh wait no this one is the one mic from JYP Nation yes so this one will go here and then we start with the album photo cards. <laughs> so first we have Around the World and then Love Train. I'm pretty sure I've put these already in chronological order, so I hope it's right. If not, feel free to correct me. <laughs> I wasn't sure if I wanted to um, film putting these cards away but I thought it was also a good way of looking at my mark collection mark non-album I guess oh this is a uh, laugh 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 and then I think this is hey ya right I think so oh yeah it is yeah it is <laughs> it says it right there I'm blind and then we have my swagger and turn up new era calendar card new era album card i will let you go calendar card i think yes and then love loop yeah we'll do it like that <laughs> and then we have sing for you um the tour cards and then road to you so this card is actually new to my collection i just got it um maybe last month from my friend so i finally have a sing for you card oh my gosh this one is also quite rare, so. <laughs> and then this one is the New Era Tour card from 2018. So it'll go right here behind the 2018 calendar. How fitting. Okay. And then for the bottom two, I have the Road to You um, special cards. I think these are... Yeah, these are tour cards also. God 7 Arena Special 2018 to 2019. So these two, oops, are gonna go right here. So there we go. Cute. Okay. And then now I have his Love Loop Polaroid set. So the first four are gonna be this these four this one is one of my favorite my one of my favorite cards ever <laughs> he's so cute um this is version one so i think i'm gonna do it by version these polaroids came with his album version so this black and white one is going to go on this page and then these two will start on this page cute okay now we are gonna have the i will let you go polaroids with bam bam so I have all four right here. We have two outside or like standing ones. This one I pulled, I'm so happy. And then we have these two, which are very, very similar. So I didn't even know this one existed. So anyways. <laughs> now 
now oh my god i'm so excited about these i finally completed his i won't let you go diamonds you guys i'm telling you these ones are so hard to come by and when you do see them they're like super expensive so the time has finally come that i completed them and they have messages on the back um this one says oh my god you're touching my heart these are like lyrics but oh my god still the cutest okay i think i'm gonna i'm gonna put these two on this page Oh my gosh, it's kind of ugly with it like um with the Polaroids on the back. Should I sleeve them in white sleeves? Would that be better? Okay, let's try this again with the white sleeved. Oh my gosh, that's so much better. Okay, and then we have Got Seven Cafe, and then the Star Collection as our last photo cards for this binder. So I have his Got Seven Cafe card. It's a little like long, so it's like sticking out of the sleeve, but that is fine. And then for the Star Collection, I do have this one Got Seven set that I think I'm just gonna put on this page just to fill it up so technically it's supposed to connect like this but obviously with my layout that's not gonna happen but I'll just put them in order regardless that's not too bad <laughs> Okay, now we'll start with Mark's Star Collection cards. So these are basically just um, trading cards. Um, they're really big though, so yeah. Okay, and this last card, I'm gonna put on the back here. Okay, there we go. And that is the last photo card for this binder, but we do have some bigger inclusions to put away. So first of all, I have his Fly In Soul Final photo card, and this photo card is huge. I don't know if you guys can tell <laughs> but i'm going to store the envelope and the photo card like this because i feel like the the envelope is really pretty too so um oh maybe it'll fit upwards oh it will okay great <gasps> that's so cute okay love that there we go okay and then on the back I have Eyes on You Thailand and Eyes on You Taiwan. So I think this one is Thailand and then this one is Taiwan. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> and then in this one pocket, I have 
the Eyes on You Lenticular. And it's gonna be the last thing to go in this binder. Oh my god, he's so cute! Okay, so that is the last thing that goes in this binder. Let's do a quick flip through. Oh my gosh, she is thick. Okay. There we go. Okay, so first binder is done and stored. Oh my god, so cute. I'm very happy with it. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, so for the second binder, um, I feel like this one is gonna be really full. <laughs> um, anyways, so this one I made as his um special slash rarer cards, and then along with his Pobs and solo stuff. I feel like that's a lot for this binder. <laughs> but we'll see how thick it becomes. I'm using the Beyond the Pages for this binder. Um, they are not double-sided. So these are just going to be single-sided. So that's why I feel like it's going to be a little on the thick side. So the first, I believe... 12 cards or 11 cards are going to be his um, special slash rare cards. So this one I have um, his Mad Thailand version. Oh my god, so cute. I love a good hoodie photo card. And then this one is Just Right Thailand version. The Beyond D pages are narrower so they don't fit. Um, regular sized sleeves so these are in um, popcorn sleeves slash mayday I think I have some in mayday but they are in this size just for reference I love these sleeves these are my favorite ones right now okay so we have flight log departure Thailand version I'm gonna go here and then I think this is, oh, this is Turbulence, Thailand edition again. He is so cute here, oh my god. I never thought that I would venture in to collecting his Thailand slash Taiwanese cards. <laughs> when I started collecting, I was like, no, I'm not even going to save the wish list because I'm never going to collect it. And here I am. Oh my god, this one is so pretty. The Eyes on You Thailand version is so pretty. I don't know if I've shown you guys this because I've had this on display on my shelf for a little bit. So yeah, the hollow border is so pretty. But yeah, I think I'm only missing like three photo cards <laughs> from his Taiwan slash Thailand version. It's actually crazy. I'm such a faker. That's why, guys, never say never because <laughs> you might eat your words. Okay, here is his Thai Thailand, his light stick card. <laughs> Got seven fly concert. That's just gonna go here. This one is so cute. I love this photo card. And then I have his Soompi card. Honestly, I don't know where this card came from, but I got it a long time ago. <laughs> and then I have his real Thai photo card and his other one. Oops. And then last but not the least, I have his Dream Night photo card. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. And that is gonna complete this page. Oh my gosh, that's already three pages. Okay. <laughs> Let's keep going. Now we move on to Pobs. So first, we have Call My Name. Because I think Call My Name was the era that like K-pop groups were starting to do pre-order benefits. 
so for call my name i have oh i have these four so this one is from shin han yeah shin han card i believe this is called my name yeah so that's gonna go first and then i have these two from with fans which is yz why now i think so oh my god i love a good chi card card you guys know that and then last for call my name i have this hollow card i'm not sure what, where this one is from i don't remember but i'll put it on the screen right now there we go and that is that for call my name pubs next one we have die and i have five pubs for this set so it's gonna have to continue to the next page i have his mask sound wave polaroid i guess i should probably um block out this qr code because i paid so much for this polaroid <laughs> this is the first expensive thing i've ever bought for my collection so yeah there is that <laughs> i keep forgetting to cover it up in my videos sadly anyways <laughs> okay and then next i have oh gosh oh with fan so this is yzy1 right right the one with the white markings and then yzy2 for die obviously why am i having so much struggles with these okay and then this is Shopee, also for dye. They had like so many versions for the same shop. So both of these two are from Shopee. Oops. Oh, this one is Ball. Oh my gosh. I guess now we're going on to Breath of Love. <laughs> This one being the first, and I have two more for this set. And then here are the two uh, Breath of Love Shopee cards that go with this one. I love this one. It looks so good in it, oh my god. Okay, and then the next page, we have Breath of Love, YZY, and Web Drama. So we have version 1, version 2, which I think is my favorite, <laughs> and then version 3 for YZY, and then this one is his whip drama card. From when I'm filming this, he just finished his show at um, in Philadelphia so oh my god and it was so good i didn't go to it obviously <laughs> but i'm keeping up with it on twitter and stuff so yeah i'm very excited for my concert this is tower records for breath of love by the way i'm very excited for my concert which is in a little bit over two weeks now but oh my gosh I'm so stoked. This is Sonara from Breath of Love. I hate these types of holo cards. Like, <laughs> it was a type of holo, like, back in the day, I guess. When they first started. <laughs> and then, for the Warner Music winner slash promotion card, I got this one. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> There are very limited amounts of these cards, so I paid an arm and a leg for that one. There's also one more. I'm just going to keep that blank for now. And now we get into the, um, the GOT7 EP dupes page, <laughs> which are his glasses cards, obviously. If you guys have been keeping up with my GOT7 videos, you know how obsessed I am with these cards. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, did I finish talking about the concert? Anyways, yeah, I'm very excited for the Vancouver show. <laughs> I think it's, uh, no, I don't think. I know it's gonna be a blast. Anyways, so this one is um, Sinara from GOT7 EP. This one is Hot Tracks. This one is Everline, yes, Everline. And then this one is Soundwave. Oh my God, can you guys, oh my, look at him. This is um a PVC card, so it's thicker, but it's from Soundwave. Oh my God. Oh my God, that's so pretty, I love it. I love it, I love it. And that ends our, um, pop section so now we get into his solo stuff we have his first photo book cards and i think i have these in order so we'll just store them like so Cute. Okay, now we get into the Treadmill magazine. I'm not the biggest fan of these cards. Only because they're the thicker kind, so they're PVC, but they, they're very slippery. So they tend to like slip out sometimes. Which I hate, but it's fine. Still cute, I guess. Okay, and then besides that, we have the Anessa photo cards, which is like a collab that he did. I have five of them. So I think maybe I'll store these three in here first. Oh no, I have a complete set. I have these three, this one, this one, this one. Getting these cards is kind of a pain because like to get them originally, you had to have bought um, three different sets. Basically, you'd have three sets of sunscreens, <laughs> which I thought was a little excessive. So I only bought one set and yeah, anyways. I don't know when I'll get the other two cards for these sets, but for now, we are going to keep it like this. I think I'm keeping these two blank, and then I'm starting pull up over here. So Mark had a fan meeting in Thailand called Pull Up. And I have four of them, or all four of his pull-up photo cards. These are also PVC, so they're hard. Um, these three are from like in person. If you were, if you went, um, I got them from an international seller. And then this one is um, a photo card that a photo card that you get if you bought the live streaming um, ticket. I didn't buy the live streaming ticket because I couldn't watch the live stream. I had my best friend's wedding. So yeah, I had to buy that one later. So that one's a new addition. I think it arrived to me a couple weeks ago. So yeah. Mark sold out Thailand, I think twice, three times. I, th I forgot already, but yeah it was a ride <laughs> these cards are so pretty oh my god i love it okay next we go into his spotlight magazine polaroids okay so spotlight had eight photo cards but i only have seven from my group order um yeah so i'm still missing one which is kind of sad 
who knows when that will turn up but that is fine I have all the time in the world <laughs> for it um we'll do this one there we go and then the other three I will put on this page these are really nice quality photo cards too um yeah I don't I don't really know how to show you they're not paper they're kind of plastic very reflective but yeah they feel really nice i know they don't scratch easily yay oh my god this one is so cute okay moving on now we get into um the other side but i don't have these pops yet we'll skip over that we will do K-Town pop-up and the Sandwave pre-order benefit though. Which are these two? Oh no, I already forgot which one is which. I think this one is K-Town and then this one is Sandwave. I think. This one is so cute. Look at him with the chain. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put K-Town on top. And then sound wave at the bottom, like that. There we go. Okay. And then we have some more the other side album polas. And then I have the China polas for also from the other side. But that is for another video because I don't have those right now. <laughs> Okay, let's do a quick flip through of this binder. Oh, she is really thick. I might... Hmm. Maybe I'll put these rare Taiwan Thailand cards in my other binder. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> okay, now for the flip through. Okay, oh my gosh. I really love the later cards. Like the pull-up cards. Oh my gosh, let me just end on this page then. <laughs> okay, so that is all for my binder makeover, Mark Twan edition. <laughs> um, I feel like it was way chaotic. I am so sorry if nothing I said made sense. Um, but yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye!